Hello, welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to show you a quicker way to export Tecla Structures model to Tecla Structural Designer for load analysis. I'm Morris Dimba and welcome once again and we'll get started right away. If you take a look on the screen, you can see a model right here. And this is the model we want to export to Tecla Structures, structure, uh, Tecla Structural Designer for load analysis. Now what I'll do, I'll just press Ctrl A just to select everything here. I want to select everything here let me click once again on empty screen okay here we are and uh, we have included everything in our selection and uh, let's wait it load still it's still loading. We'll give it time to load fully. Okay, everything has been included in our selection. And uh, now we want to export this to Tecla Structural Designer for load analysis. Okay, we'll go straight away to, to file here. I'll click that. I'll click file. Then I'll come to export straight away right here. Then I'll scroll down to uh, Tecla Structural Designer here. Then I'll click OK. Then I'll come to uh, export file. I'll click uh, this radio button just to 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 give it a name or, or to define a route for my file. Then I'll just click that. There we are. Now here we'll feed the name of the file we want to export. We'll just give it maybe a shop one. I mean shop two. Or shop three let me just give it shop three now the file has been named now let's just go straight away and click save that's it now this is the root for a file it's under C Drive Tecla structures model then this is the model in Tecla structures now inside this uh, model folder is where we, we will find our file named shop three and uh, with that extension of X, uh, CXL. Now, once that has been done, just go ahead and click export and wait for the result. Or we'll follow it. then uh, once it has been exported, we'll follow this under our Tecla structural, uh, under, our, under our Tecla structures model folder and we'll get this file here, shop three CXL. Then we'll put it into Tecla Structural Designer for load analysis. We'll give it time to 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 process the export. Then we'll follow it thereafter. There we are. Our export is complete now. Now what I'll do? We'll just go ahead and click close. You can also see here export is complete. We have some bit of some number of warnings here and zero and zero error and a neutral file was created. Neutral file was created successfully. Now we have number of n n members here. We have 1,121. Now I'll just go ahead and close this. Then uh, I'll track my file under the Tecla structure. Tecla structures uh, 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 file. Uh, I mean folder file. Uh, I mean uh, I mean Tecla structures folder. Now I'll close this. Now what I'll do? I'll go straight away to Tecla structures model. Let me just go back. You go to Drive C, then come to Tecla structures model. Just open this, and and remember the name we gave to our file to, to the file we were exporting from Tecla structures to Tecla structural designer now I'll just scroll down uh, tracking my file Tecla structures file it is here workshop now under workshop just double click then uh, we'll track down this file called shop 3 this one here now we'll pick on this file right click and come to and uh, we'll, we'll copy it on the, on, the, on the desktop where we'll be able to access it easily. I'll just copy, click copy, 
and minimize this then i'll minimize that i'll paste this on my desktop right here i'll paste it here once it has once it has been pasted there i'll come back to i'll come back to tecla's structural design right here then i'll come straight to new here i'll click on that and i'll give you time to load okay it's loading now we'll just wait for it to load completely so that we can import our file into tecla structural designer for load analysis though i will not perform the load analysis fully just show you how to export it in tecla structural designer from tecla structures software now here we are and uh, what i'll do now i'll come straight to structural beam import i'll click on that beam import then uh, in this uh, uh, dialog box i'll click on this button then this from here i'll be heading straight to my folder i saved it on my desktop i just click desktop then i'll, I'll, I'll scroll down and pick on shop 3 right there and you can also see we've been restricted to this type of file cxl file now just click on that and click open there we are it, it can also detect the version that was was used to to, to model that structure to take a structural tecla structures 18 now what i'll go ahead and do and just click next uh, top of steel uh, then uh, i used this uh, i used the euro code you can also pick the the code of your preference you can pick australia like uh, one of my followers was struggling to pick a particular code of his area but he was unable to succeed now here you can pick the appropriate code uh, i'm using the U U uk code i'll just let it remain at uh, uk code now i'll go ahead and click next from here i'll g just go straight and click next i'll continue and click next and give it time to process that information there we are and uh, it is unable to uh, to detect what type of material is this it, it is not within uh, the tecla structural design database now what i'll do I'll just click on this uh, drop down arrow and uh, 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 um, identify it manually that this is steel and i'll do the same thing here i'll click this drop down arrow and uh, identify it manually as steel then uh, grade it doesn't recognize that grade i'll give it that grade as 275 and this also i'll give it as 275 now what i'll do i'll just go ahead and click finish and here also we'll give it time to load the whole model inside our tecla, stru tecla structural designer so that i can take you briefly on how to move around with the model imported from tecla structure <coughs> perfect it has been uh, it has been imported and uh, we have it now in, te in tecla structural designer and i'll take you briefly on how i'll take you briefly on on, on the on the menu bar here i'll uh, come to home here then uh, i'll click model settings here from here you can see you can see still see the 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 codes used design codes you have australia europe india ireland all these let me close that and i'll switch back to i'll come to load here you have seismic just click on seismic and uh, you can go ahead and click on seismic also here we are we can click next if uh, we wish to proceed i'm not willing to proceed now that is for another 
presentation. Now, uh, you come to the composition right there and uh, just go ahead and click the composition right there. Perfect. Let me just turn this around. It has not, it has not recognized our sheet. It has been recognized as a beam because is, beam is what we use to to convert into sheet. Now let me just turn this down so that you can see everything clearly. Perfect. And uh, we'll wind up on that spot. And that is a quicker way on how to e export your model to a structural designer for your load analysis. Thanks a lot for watching this video. I'm Morris Dimba. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos will come. Bye bye. And uh, let's meet on the next presentation.